Volunteers and staff with Parkside Community Church began planting tomatoes, zucchini, squash, jalapenos, and herbs over the weekend. They also took soil delivery and look forward to having a source of fresh fruit and vegetables available to their community. Um, our goal is to uh, engage some of the community around here. If they'd like to work, we'd love, to come, love, love them to come help us. If that works out. When the, when the fruit or the produce starts coming up, uh, they're welcome to come, come get what they need. Organizers emphasized the importance of getting outside and connecting again after over a year of isolation related to COVID. I think it can be a great opportunity to get back outside and meet some neighbors. We've been, you know, so separate now for more than a year. And I think there's people that need to know who their neighbors are and are looking for new places to connect, new places to serve. Expansion of the garden is planned and organizers pushed the importance of the garden as a learning opportunity. We've already gotten some interest in the community, the, uh, just some people driving by looking at what we're doing. We've got plenty of space to make another garden spot. So as we see how this one progresses, we may start a fall garden later in the year, another plot. Uh, and then um, we've got another two acres on the other side of us. I'm not for sure that we become that big of farmers, but you know, if it starts meeting some community needs, we'd certainly uh, move forward with that project. The next garden work days will be Thursday, April 22nd, Earth Day, and Thursday, April 29th.